Uh, the stages are pretty dusty, pretty challenging, um, lots of rocks. It's going to be a long, hard uh, safari rally. Uh, the stages are quite tough. Um, yeah, they're very uh, technical and unforgiving, so you really got to keep on the, on the track. First impression is, this is my first time doing Reiki, so the whole experience was new, but it was just nice to see where all the stones are. Of course, I've been warned that there's a lot of stones, so I got to see that. Um, but there's some really nice long 500 meter, 600 meter long sections, so I'm just looking forward to soaking it all in. Of course, as we all know, WRC is the biggest motorsport event that we have. And bringing it back to Kenya after 19 years is a, it's a dream come true for all the drivers. Well, this is a big thing. I mean, it's been 19 years. Uh, 19 years ago, I was a little uh, toddler. So, I mean, we've always looked up to, uh, to the WRC. My dad's done the WRC. Um, I think he finished 12th in one of the safaris. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's just, it's a, you know, it's, a, it's our wildest dreams coming to life, uh, just getting a chance to race with the best in the world. I, I grew up with people telling me how they used to watch rally and everything, so it's nice for myself to have the privilege to actually take part in what's a historic event, so for it coming back and for me being a part of it, when it comes back, I'm really privileged for that. This is my first rally, so this is all new and yeah, it's my first rally. So this is all new and yeah, it's quite overwhelming, quite um, enjoyable, just a lot of excitement. So yeah, it's quite privileged to be here. Yeah. but a little mistake there at the end. Yeah, um, uh, didn't expect it. Uh, I've only done 15 Ks in the car, but uh, yeah, it was a bit looser than I expected. But uh, no, we had good fun. Big day. Uh, yesterday uh, was a short day, um, but uh, it's just to uh, keep it on the road and uh, you know go as quickly as we can without getting any punches. Uh, so uh, with, and also without getting stuck after the second run because uh, Kedong is uh, you know it's known for getting uh, really degraded. Uh, today is a long day uh, with a long stage uh, Kedong, so I just want to keep it clean, uh, keep it tidy, and try to bring the car back in one piece. We have repeat stages in the afternoon of what we did in the morning. So I'm just planning to maybe take it 70, 80% in the morning, see what the, the, the course is like, and then in the afternoon I can start to push myself. But with every stage, I'm just learning new skills. This is now the first proper rally. Yesterday was a, almost like a circuit stage. So now, now the marathon begins, looking forward, yeah. a tricky morning we didn't have uh, the first two stages right now I caught Dil Raj and I, I've been sitting on his dust for half of the stage so I've lost a lot of time yeah today has been a very difficult day uh, very challenging one of the most challenging days of my rallying career Lots of dust, lots of big ruts, and uh, it was in some places it was impossible to pass, but we're happy to be here. Uh, it's been a long day. Um, we didn't uh, get to finish a single stage of all red flag. Uh, we got into uh, Chui on the second pass, and uh, we got bogged, and uh, we managed to, uh, to dig ourselves out in 12 minutes before the time bar. Uh, we went a couple of uh, 100 meters up, and everyone was still stuck, so there was no way we also got stuck. Um, but no, I mean, that's part of the safari, it's a journey. Safari means journey. 
and uh, no it's part of the game and uh, i mean we still we still in the game so we get to uh, fight tomorrow it was a long day a lot of driving but short that we only did two stages out of six but i enjoyed the two stages and they went well so i'm happy with that yeah good morning. Everything was smooth, clear. Um, the tracks are different to yesterday. A lot smoother, faster. Uh, so yeah, just really enjoyed. Got to push the car to its maximum and trust its limits. So had a fun morning. I wouldn't have thought of being in this position. So hopefully we can maintain it. And just, I'm still learning. So hopefully there's more to come and we can still keep making progress. Uh, no, it was uh, going well. Uh, we, uh, we, we set a good time. Uh, in the first stage in uh, Elementita, but uh, so Isambu we caught up to our teammates Dust, he was having some mechanical issues, so for about 15 kilometers we sat in uh, Dust, and then uh, Sleeping Warrior was going really well until we punctured, uh, so that's my first uh, puncture in my rallying career so far, uh, but yeah we changed it and we got on, yeah we had good fun through the stages. Uh, today has been very difficult, um, the car has been losing power the whole morning, so we've been struggling in the first three stages, but now we're back to service to try and fix it and attack on the next three. Right now I have nothing to lose, I, I just have to go flat out. Element tighter, it was better, I improved on my time and then I think Swaisambu was pretty much the same. Just now in Kedong it started raining, so half the track was wet, half the track was dry, so I got caught out in one of the wet sections and, and slid backwards, but I was okay then. Then I think we must have hit a rock somewhere, because we got a puncture and then a power cut out. So we lost maybe 10 minutes. If you look at the times here, yeah, the group I was in are now 10 minutes ahead. And that's about how much time I lost with that. So, but anyway, now I know how to drive or not drive the car in the wet. And I think that's one of the trickiest sections now done. So tomorrow we'll hope to regain those places. I know our uh, day was fantastic. Uh, lots of surprises. We got the rain in, well, it's safari, yeah? It's not a proper safari until you have some mud and some rain. So uh, it was very interesting, uh, but we punched it twice on the Sleeping Warrior section. The first one we hit a rock, the second one we were unlucky, we knocked it off the bead in the mud. Uh, but no, overall we had fun, we were really, uh, we were hauling. So, and we're getting used to the car and we're now beginning to bed in with the car. So no, really good, kilometer by kilometer, we're just getting quicker and getting used to the car. So all in all, a very good day, a very fun, uh, action-packed day. It was incredible, the car is amazing. We pushed really hard on the second loop. We got a bit of time from the first loop. Tomorrow is a new day, so it's still the safari. We'll still push the, till the end of the, the safari because anything can happen tomorrow. Uh, especially right now in the last stage, it rained for something that we didn't expect. So it's the safari, you have to take it as it comes. It's been a good event, a long one, starting to get a bit tired now, but yeah, last day, short stages, so it will be more like a sprint, but the main thing is we've gotten this far, so we just want to cross the finish line and hopefully maintain the position where we're at, if not finish better. Uh, we didn't have a good, uh, a very, uh, should I say, a very productive day uh, the day before yesterday. Um, but I mean, you know, it's safari, but we've managed to catch the 20 minutes up and we have a four minute gap to the lead of our class. So, I mean, uh, we're going to try and push as hard as we can, but also taking into consideration yesterday we lost. We could have been in the lead, 
we got two punches. One of them we hit a rock, the other came off the beat in the mud. Um, but uh, no, today it's just to go and, uh, I mean, we're going all out, but uh, at a controlled rate, yeah, of just coming in clean. There are so many emotions. Um, I'm just hoping that I can get to the end. It will be my first WRC finish, uh, my first safari finish. And um, it, it has been a long rally, uh, tough. And I'm just waiting for it to come to an end and be to the podium. I'm kind of being relieved also that, yeah, across the line, that was the main target at the beginning of the, the rally, so happy to have done that. They didn't put the easiest stage for the last stage, but yeah, just happy to have crossed the line and now we can go and relax afterwards with the team and thanks to everyone who's helped be a part of this. I'm really happy and on to the next one. We're superbly happy, we thought after we got stuck uh, on the first run, we had a uh, uh, our rear brakes uh, jammed up, we got stuck in this uh, same stage and uh, unfortunately one of our teammates was stuck so we've kind of still got onto the podium, just zipped on. Uh, but yeah, it's been a real tough uh, tough work getting through, through there. Uh, but yeah, we're really happy to get through and this is amazing, a dream come true to finish the WRC and now home country. Uh, congratulations to Mr. Ogier for taking the win on our home turf and uh, yeah, uh, fantastic uh, event, really uh, toughest safari I've ever done.